Origins Part 2 Continued The Tower of Babel After the account in Chapter 9 about Noah and his sons after the flood, we have the Table of Nations in Chapter 10, which recounts the spread of peoples and nations over the earth and gives one a sense of in the world view of that time, what the, the sort of geography and eth ethnography was of the ancient world. Chapter 11 then begins with the statement that all nations had a common speech and they determined to build a city with a tower reaching to the heavens. This tower, scholars think, is probably based on the Mesopotamian ziggurat and that is Cities were really in their origins in, say, four, you know, 4,000 years ago, were probably primarily public buildings with a temple at the center. So the ziggurat is part of a temple complex and symbolically represents a staircase by which the god or the goddess descends to the temple not intended for humans to climb up. And here are some, one is a, a, a reconstruction, a reconstructed drawing of what the ziggurat would be, where you have these long staircases with the temple on top. And at the bottom right, you have the ziggurat of Ur, which is all you really have left is the platform of the temple. You don't actually have the temple itself. And you can see even so, it's a pretty massive construction. So what's the problem? The problem is the motivation. Let us make a name for ourselves. As Adam and Eve tried to grasp knowledge for themselves, and it thus became twisted, so the people of Shinar want to make a name for themselves rather than a name for God, and so they are sent away from the city. But the intent in the Old Testament is that Jerusalem or Zion will be the garden, the city which will gather in the nations. And in the same way, the calling of Abraham is intended to reverse the scattering of the nations. And so God is the one who will make Abraham's name great. Abraham will not grasp that for himself, but is something that God will grant. The problem with knowledge that is grasped for oneself is that the only way one can know the, no the knowledge of evil is to do it, basically. So grasping glory for oneself ends up in degradation.